Hey guys, what's happening? DX Parker here with you. I'm going to do a quick video today about the tech mats. I was watching Oil Gun and the Haas USMC videos on these things, and they spoke highly of them. I've always wanted to try one of these mats for whenever I'm cleaning or working on one of my guns, but never did drop the hammer for whatever reason. But after watching their videos, I thought now would be the perfect time, so I went ahead and ordered up a couple. The first ones I ordered up were for the Glock and the 1911. As you can see, you get the exploded view of your firearm, and it lists all the parts. Tells you a little bit of history of the, the firearm. You know, the difference between compact, subcompact, full size, 1911, basically the same thing. These uh, mats are really nice for what you pay for them. They're like $13, $14 a piece. You get a polyester top. The paint's sunk into the material, so you don't have to worry about scratching the the white off or the lettering off. The bottom's made out of neoprene rubber. They provide a good protection whenever you're either cleaning or working on your weapon. Best thing about them whenever you're finished with them, you can roll them up. They don't uh, conform to whatever shape you you roll them in or fold them in whenever you're finished with it. You can just roll it up. And you're going to use it again, unroll it. There you have it. No creases. I really, really like these things. Um, so I went ahead and picked up another set. I got a set for the M&P model pistols. And then as you can see, I got one for a long rifle, Ruger 1022. So whenever I'm working on my weapons, I'm going to be using these tech mats. I suggest you guys give them a try. They're well worth the money. If you uh, use the code all the gun or the Hoss USMC, you'll get a uh, slight discount. I think it's 20 or 25 percent. Don't have uh, much invested in these, and they're worth every dime of it. But uh, just wanted to share that little bit with you. Hope you guys have a good Easter, and we'll catch you later.